Things happening right now, local heroes in D.C. on the trip of a lifetime. Yeah, each one served our country during the Vietnam War, and as we all remember, they were not really welcomed home. Now, Flag City Honor Flight is making sure they see the memorials built in their honor. Dan Cummins traveling with them once again and joins us from the nation's capital. Dan? The day began bright and early, a breakfast honoring our 85 Vietnam veterans on Flag City Honor Flight. Loading the plane, taking off at 8.15 arriving in Baltimore an hour later. Flag City on her flight with veterans from Vietnam. God bless our veterans. God bless America. A bus ride to Washington, D.C. Our first stop was the Marine Memorial, Iwo Jima. Then onto the World War II Memorial, Korea and Vietnam. The veterans on our trip all signed a T-shirt to leave at the base of the wall. High school students Jake Van Atta from Macomb and Macy Adams from Rossford volunteering as guardians, learning history, sacrifice, patriotism. Um, I'm very impressed on how prideful they are and how much they really do care. And that, that is really why I'm here to show him my guy that I really am thankful. And, it's just, it's a different experience seeing it first person instead of just yeah, seeing right. it over sure. the internet or whatever. You see the healing process taking place here today and with all of these veterans and like them finding names of their brothers, their friends, like just, you see that healing process take place today and I'm just happy to be a part of it. So it has been an emotional day for these Vietnam veterans here at the wall and in Washington, D.C. at the monuments. Now we're going to head back to Toledo. We should be coming in tonight for a big homecoming at Grand Air Terminal at 10 o'clock and 11 o'clock. I'll be reporting live from there then. Reporting from Washington, D.C. with Flag City Honor Flight, I'm Dan Cummins. I just love, too, that the high schoolers there got to have that experience, and I think that's something they're going to remember for the rest of their lives, doing that for those veterans. Yeah, they're starting to see, obviously, a big sign-up for veterans, but a big sign-up for volunteers as well.